Hi, Keith here with Tractor Pal, the inventory and maintenance manager for not only tractors, but also all types of machinery and vehicles. First off, I'd like to say thank you for downloading Tractor Pal. We're grateful for all of the users of the app, and we hope you enjoy it and also tell your friends about Tractor Pal. This is the fourth video in the Tractor Pal series, teaching you how to use the Tractor Pal app. In this video, you'll learn all the in app features and how to use them. In the other videos, we tell you the basics of the app, how to add machinery inventory and also record maintenance if you like to skip this in-app purchase selection of the video please see the links below for the other videos this video is created using the iphone tractor pal is also available in android and the instructions are very similar if you have any questions please email us at questions at tractorpal.com so let's get started by opening the app i have to assume you've already watched the first three videos in those videos, I've shown you the basics on how to use the app and also walked you through how to add a John Deere 4020 into the inventory side of the app. And finally, how to record maintenance. Now, I'll show you the in-app purchases option. In the free version of the app, you have the ability to add one tractor or machine, all inventory options, and all maintenance options. Then, with the in-app purchase, you have the ability to add more than one tractor or machines. You're able to email the reports and change the background. If you currently have the free version and you try to add more than one tractor or machine, you get an error saying this feature requires activation. Do you want to purchase? At this point, please select OK and process a $4.99 upgrade to the app. We hope you can support us in this adventure. On my phone, of course, I've already purchased the app. After you made your purchase, you'll be at the main screen of the app. Now when you press add, the app automatically adds another inventory line. The keyboard pops up and the cursor is flashing in the area that says type machine name now. You can go ahead and type in the machine name. If you're unfamiliar with this process, see the links below for the inventory instruction video. So adding more than one machine is one of the options you receive with your purchase. Also, you receive the ability to email reports. When you touch the email report button, a pop-up window displays and then gives you a list of options, including all info, machinery and serial numbers, machinery only, machinery and all inventory. Report for one machine. Depending on how the information you would like to email depends on which selection you would like to make. For now, since we only have the 4020 in the app, let's just select Report for One Machine. When we do that selection, an option will have another pop-up window to select the machine. Again, in this case, we just have the 4020. If there were other tractors in the app, we would just select the one we want. When you touch the 4020, a little blue check mark appears to the right. Then select Send. The report processes into a PDF format. You can then review the document and then touch send PDF. That option is in blue. It then opens your mail application and you can then process it just like an email by typing in an email and touch send. Again, I'm doing this on an iPhone, so the Android will be different, but I hope you get the idea. The last thing you receive in the paid for app is the option to remove the TractorPal icon in the background. To do this, select the gear or options icon in the top right hand corner of the app. When you do that, you'll see the change background. There are two options, choose image or use default. Use default means it will just put the tractor pal icon back on the background. Let's select choose image. You will then get a pop up saying choose image in portrait mode. This means having the phone up and down. Otherwise, if you select a picture that is sideways, it will distort the picture and will stretch to fit. You can either take a new picture from the camera or open gallery, which will take one already on your phone. From there, it's easy. Just select the picture or take a new one. Those are the options of the in-app features. If you have any questions, again, email us at questions at tractorpal.com. Thank you for downloading, and again, please consider supporting our app. If you haven't already, purchase the full version for $4.99. If you haven't downloaded TractorPal yet, you can do so at android.tractorpal.com 
for your Android phone or apple.tractorpal.com for iPhones. Please follow us on Twitter at TractorPal underscore app or find us on Facebook, facebook.com slash TractorPal. And of course, at TractorPal.com. Thanks for watching.